Hello fellow Notion users and welcome back to another Notion tutorial. In today's quick, simple tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create dividers that are different colors and different widths in Notion. Right now, with the basic Notion setup, we're limited to uh, gray dividers, simple gray dividers. But what I have kind of uh, figured out here is you can create multicolored dividers just like this to split your pages up. And I found this tip on the Notion subreddit, a user Lari Nail. I probably butchered that name, but they posted this and decided to showcase what they were doing over in Notion. So the Notion subreddit can be a really good place to find quick tips and tricks like this, kind of like hidden gems. I'm going to show you how to actually create these custom dividers. It's actually very simple because as you know, if you're typing out text and then you want a divider, right now you can create a simple gray divider that looks like this. But this divider isn't very versatile. You know, you can't do much with that. But these dividers here, you can change the color and you can change the height of them as well. So let me show you how to do that. All you're gonna do is head down to the description and I have this code in the description and you can just copy that and paste it right into your Notion workspace and it should function correctly. So if I hit copy right here, just to grab that text, and then I paste it down here, as you can see, it's red off of the start, and that's because we have it set to red. If you wanna change the color, you can use a hex code. So for hex code, you're just gonna put the pound sign, and then you're going to enter the color that you want. So 0000000, 000 000 would be like the black. Uh, you can also type a few different colors in here and they'll work, like blue, for instance. Um, but what I recommend is just finding the color that you want and then typing it in here. If you have trouble finding this hex code, you can head over to htmlcolorcodes.com and you can use this color picker and it will generate the hex code for the color that you're looking for. So just change it to the color that you want, like maybe this bluish greenish color, and then you can copy this hex code, command C, and you can paste it in here, and we have that color right here in our Notion workspace, okay? So that's how you change the color. You can also change the height of this and the like width. So if I change this to like 200, it's going to make a little bit of a smaller divider and I could also change the width of this to like 10 and that would make it super thick. So there are a lot of parameters that you can edit here and this makes your dividers much better in my opinion than just sticking with these simple gray dividers like this. But as you can see, if I don't hit done on this after I edit it, it doesn't set it. So make sure to hit done. And like I said, all you have to do is copy this, paste it as a text block into Notion, like anywhere where there's just a blank space, like right here, I could just paste it and I'm gonna get that. And then you can edit the color by changing the hex code and you can edit the ruling here by changing these two parameters. So the link to that code will be down in my description and I will also have a link to the original subreddit where this was shared so that you guys can check that out as well if you wanna learn more about how this works. Thank you so much for watching this video, and I hope that this helps you take your Notion aesthetic to a new level. All right, we'll see you in the next one.